my name is Maggie and welcome back to my channel. I will be a first year Dallas student this August and in this video I will be sharing my undergraduate GPA, my DAP scores, which schools I applied to last cycle, so that's the 2021-2022 application cycle, which schools I interviewed at, which schools I got accepted into, and finally, which school I will be going to. So without any further ado, let's get straight into today's video. So I went to Monmouth University, which is located in New Jersey for three and a half years and graduated early with a degree in biology with a concentration in molecular cell physiology and ended with a 3.781 GPA. So I then took the dental admission test, also known as the DAT, my uh, junior year. I studied very diligently that fall semester because I just wanted to finish everything in one go. I didn't want to retake it second time. And so on my first try, I ended with a 20 in perceptual ability, 18 in quantitative reasoning, 19 in reading comprehension, 18 in biology, 22 in general chemistry, 20 in organic chemistry, and my total science average and academic average ended up being 19. Now, I understand that these scores are average and most students would retake it, but after speaking with current dental students and practicing dentists, I was told that dental schools look at applications holistically. And if you don't have any scores under 18, you should be fine. And so there were certain aspects of my application that really stood out. And that's one of the main reasons why I felt comfortable applying to all these schools with the scores that I received. The next thing I had to decide was which schools I wanted to apply to. So I made a list of things that I was looking for in dental schools, like location and clinical experience. And I picked out 10 schools that interested me um, in the United States. I categorized the schools that I picked out into safe and read schools. And so I ended up applying to NYU, Stony Brook, Boston University, University of Pitt, University of Penn, University of Maryland, Rutgers, Lecom, Columbia, and Temple. So over a span of a few months, I received interviews from Lecom, Stony Brook, University of Maryland, Rutgers, and NYU. officially accepted into Stony Brook, Lecom, NYU, and Rutgers. And so the school that I will be attending this August is Rutgers! I am so so excited about this you know, next part in my life. Um, it's a new journey, it's a little intimidating, but I'm sure it'll be fine. Rutgers has been my top choice because it is in state, so it's closer to home. It has a wonderful clinical experience, lots of outreach programs, and students, when they graduate, feel more prepared and confident when entering the field. And so I'm super grateful and happy with how things have turned out and I'm looking forward to this new journey. And so if you found this video to be helpful, please like, share, and subscribe. It will mean a lot to me and I will see you in the next video.